Hello everyone, it's Gigi, and I hope y'all had a really fantastic weekend. And I have some happy mail, a haul, and a project share, okay? So first, let me show you this. Look at this bubble wrap. Isn't it adorable? It is hearts. I have never seen that before. So Raquel, you need to tell me where you got this, hun. I want to get some. That is so sweet to send. So Raquel from Paints and Glitter sent me this beautiful winter card. I had commented on her channel when she showed some cards um, how beautiful this one was. And she had a scripture verse on the inside. And I just loved it. And she sent it to me. So sweet of her. And she left me a lovely message on the inside. Thank you so much, Raquel. And look how she did a little doily that she made here that she um, hand-stitched. And it is so cute, this snowman, and how she um, cut these apart and made it dimensional. Um, so y'all should definitely check her channel out, Paints and Glitter, here on YouTube. And her name again is Raquel, and she is a sweetheart. Thank you so much, hon. I appreciate it. It's going on my board in front of me so that I can admire it when I'm crafting. And then next, Dee, who is Elegant Embellishments here on YouTube, sent me Happy Meal. And she sent me this Peachy Keen new stamp that came out. And it's Peppermint Polly, Sprinkled Sandy, and Valentine Val. So it's the Gingerbread Doll Stamp Set. And it is adorable. And the size of them is really nice. They're such a good size, and they're so stinking cute. Dee, thank you so much, hun. You are the sweetest. I am so happy to have this in my collection, and I hope to make some beautiful cards with it. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, next, Polka Doodles was having a sale with 40% off. And so I picked up some images that Jill Norwood happened to show that she made projects with. So I wanted this one. It's called Frostella Ginger. And I picked up this one. It's called Winter Smile Hello. And it made them really inexpensive with the 40% off. Not that they're expensive to begin with, but 40% off is awesome. So printed those out and I'm excited about playing with those and then next I went to Walmart and we were getting groceries and I checked the pants well first I picked up some paper which I've been using already a lot actually and I get this pen and gear uh, premium card stock is 110 pounds and you get 150 sheets and I use this in my printer to print out my images um, so that's the only thing I use it for and then I use it for Copics for the images that I print but otherwise I use Nina but it doesn't take my Nina my printer so I have to use this one so I had to pick some more of that up, and it looks like pretty soon I'm going to have to pick up some more again. And then I went down the clearance aisle just to see what they had, and I found some Christmas uh, ribbon, and it was only $0.10 cents a piece. So I got this one here that is red, and it's kind of sheer with the glitter, and it's wired, and I was so excited that it was wired so that I can use it on my tags. Oh, I thought this would be so pretty. And then I got this one right here with the little um, dashes on it. And it's also wired. And you get so much. You get 25 feet on both rolls. It is like, there is a ton on these. So um, I was happy to get these for 10 cents each. They were regularly $2.58. So that was a fun find. And then we went to um, H-E-B, which is our 
our grocery store and I found this candle and it's called Fall Festival with essential oils and it's a marbled candle. And guys, this candle smells so good. It smells like cinnamon and spices. And right now that I just opened it, oh my gosh, it smells so good. And it's a two wick candle. I love it when they have more than one wick because then it burns evenly. So I grabbed that and I will be burning that one in my craft room. And then I went to Target um, with my husband because on Monday we had went to get glasses. Well, we went to get our eyes checked and then we got glasses. So I can't wait to get those in. Um, but anyway, I got these Jelly Bellies and you get 49 flavors and I love Jelly Bellies. I actually, my favorite is the licorice one. I want to get a bag of that, guys. Oh my gosh, I love licorice. If they had just that bag, I would so get it. So, um, yeah, my favorite. And then they had this, which I've never seen before. They had Jelly Belly gummies. And it comes with a lemon, berry blue, berry cherry, orange, and green apple. So I wanted to give these a go and see if I liked them. And my hubby was like, oh, I want some of those too. So he grabbed him one too. And then I checked the uh, dollar area and I found this cute little guy. He's not little actually, he's pretty big. And I had to have him for my craft room. I'm gonna put some candy that I got in here. Not that candy, but he was $5. And he is so stinking cute. I love him. So I had to pick him up. So glad to find him. And I picked up two other things from Target. I found these spritz stickers. You get 136 counts. They have glitter, foam. Um, there are some conversation ones in here. Some just colored chipboard ones. Um, I'm trying to see if you can see the word ones. Because there are words in here somewhere. Okay, I don't know if you're going to get to see them. But there are some words in here. And then there's some printed ones. Like those. Um, but you get 136 and they are or worth $3.00. In all different sizes so I liked them so I grabbed those and then the last thing I got from Target was this spritz bottle craft bucket is what it's called and it comes with 10 craft sticks um, which basically is the popsicle sticks and they're colored you get 15 paper hearts 10 holographic hearts 5 corrugated hearts 30 wiggle eyes, 10 fuzzy sticks, which is the Chanel stems, 10 pom-poms, 10 paper straws, um, one sticker sheet, three mini markers, and one white glue tube, and one bucket. And here are the stickers. There's the Chanel stems, there's the glue, there's some pom-poms, there's the sticks in all different colors. And there are the, see if I can get them over here. There's some wiggly eyes up there, and there's a whole bunch of the hearts. And these hearts are bigger than the other ones. Let me see if I can get this off. Oh yeah. Here's the markers. Let's see. I'm trying not to make this long. And I can't get them. Here we go. Here's like some of the, there's the wiggly eyes and they come in different sizes. And here are the hearts, some of the hearts. Oh, and there's chipboard ones. Cute. There's smaller hearts in here also. And there's straws. And I like the size of these. Um, I saw somebody do a project with some straws that I want to try. I gotta figure out who I watched though. And then you get some Chanel stems. 
different colors. And some pom-poms. And the popsicle sticks are in here. Let's see if I can get those. So I can show you. So you get different popsicle sticks. They're pretty colors. And they're thinner. Um, well, smaller than the ones you find like at Dollar Tree. So that's what you get. And this was five dollars. Okay. And then I went to the Dollar Tree. Or I should say the Dollar Twenty Five Tree. <laughs> so I found these cute Mickey Mouse socks, and I absolutely love them. So cute. So I grabbed myself those, and I only saw one pair of them. And then I was on the hunt for the rabbit, but I wanted the chocolate one or the brown one, but they did not have it. They had this one though. So I grabbed this one and I'm going to put him up on my craft desk like I did Santa at Christmas. I love him. So cute. Her, I should say, because she's pink. But I do want that brown one if I get to find it. Okay, and then I picked up some ribbon. And it is the Joanne brand, which is nice. You get nine feet. And I got these two. And I was happy to find this one because I saw some other girls haul it. And they were saying it matched the Phil and Frosty collection. And guys, it does. It matches so good. Look at this. Isn't that pretty together? So I'm going to stick that in there with that so that I can have it with that collection and use it with that. And I wanted to share that in case some of you have it and are looking. And this was the other one I got, the polka dots. So cute. And then I found um, these hearts. I found one and Tina Bean got me some. She got me the ones that look more prim. So I can't wait to get those. These are more um, swishy. Like, um, I don't know how to explain it. More with a swoosh on it. And then I decided to pick me up one more of these because I want to make the banners out of them. Little um, flags. Okay, and then I picked up these cute chicks. Aren't those adorable? You get 14. And then I picked up the bunnies. And I picked up the eggs. The little miniatures are so cute. And then I found the carrots this year. I'm so happy. So I got two of them. And I found an egg and a bunny. So I got one each of those. And I was so happy to find these. I had been looking and looking and looking. Finally found them. So I got me several of these heart wood pieces. I figured I could do the same thing like I did for Christmas and I can make cookies out of them and magnets. So that would be fun. And, oh, I also found some carrots. I thought these were so stinking cute. And then I found some pom-pom trim. They had it in other colors too, but I didn't like the other two colors. So I got them in yellow and blue. And then Tina got me turned on to the strawberry flavored hard candies. This is what I'm gonna put in my little gnome. Um, I used to eat these all the time growing up with that Hickory Farms because they had them in their little thing when my parents would buy their holiday gifts kits that they had. 
so I got those. And I think... Oh, and then the last thing I picked up, it's not really crafty, but I grabbed me some of this nail polish. I thought it was so pretty. And I'm going to change my nails out and do this one with gold flecks. Oh, lastly, I have my project share. So, I'll show you what I used, and I created some bag toppers because I'm entering a give or a challenge, and I wanted to do bag toppers on the package. So, I used these foam roses from Dollar Tree. I used some laser words from the Dollar Tree, and they say hugs. Then I used this die here from my creative time is called Ginger's Doily Dies, and I used the large one. And then I used some stickers from my stash from Recollections, and I had got them at Tuesday morning from 2020. They're really pretty. They have sewing down the middle, stitching, and then they're layered three times. They're really pretty. I used some doilies that was from my stash. And then I used some iridescent glitter dust. And I used my hot glue gun. And, oh, I also used, I don't know where they are. Oh, yes, I do. They're right here. And then I used these corrugated hearts from Hobby Lobby. And they were $2.99 with 40% off. And this is what I made for the first bag topper. And this is what I made for the second bag topper. And I thought they turned out so pretty. And I got the idea from Lilo Crafts. Hi, Raina, if you're watching, you should, guys should definitely check her out. So thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. Bye.